women's title. And we are back live here, folks, in the sold-out Nassau Coliseum here in Uniondale, New York. And the following is a first-round intercontinental tournament match. Making his way to the ring, he weighs in at 287 pounds. Mankind. Well, Mankind grew up right here on Long Island, and we know this Sunday at Judgment Day on pay-per-view, Mankind will meet Ken Shamrock, and that'll be one-on-one. -on -one. Now, earlier today, uh, Mike Boko had the opportunity to catch up with Mankind, and here's what Mankind had to say about Judgment Day. Mankind, the Judgment Day, you have to take on Ken Shamrock, and you gotta be angry after Shamrock leveled you recently with a chair. Well, not really. You see, the, the fact of the matter is, is that Ken Shamrock doesn't really swing a chair hard enough to hurt me. As a matter of fact, in all the years and all the times I've been being hit with chairs, the one by Shamrock was the weakest, wimpiest, and wishy-washiest of them all, so I'm not all that concerned about Ken Shamrock at Judgment Day, and if he doesn't like it, well, I've got one word for him. Socko! Have a nice day! Oh, he is one of a kind, no doubt about it. It's Mick Foley from right here on Long Island. That's, that explains what's wrong with him right there. And his opponent, oh, man. from Silsby, Texas, weighing in at 400 pounds, the world's strongest man, Mark Henry! Yeah! Well, Mark Henry here in the Intercontinental Title Tournament He's also going to face The Rock this Sunday at Judgment Day on pay-per-view. At least that's what's scheduled as we speak. And of course, Mark Henry may be the cure for mankind or whatever's wrong with him. Mark Henry is suing China, as we all know, for sexual harassment. And uh, of course, uh, Mark I, Henry... I still got those papers, you know. Mark Henry wanted to give China a special message, much like we heard yesterday morning on Superstars, a poem for China. China, to see you smile is like watching the sunrise. The more that it happens, the brighter the skies. I only wish and only dream that somehow that you feel the same. I wait the time, travel the distance, take my chance and be persistent. My only wish is that we have the best. I give all of that if I could have one chance. Give me a break. What? That was a, that brought a tear to my eye. Well, we are past the poetry now. This will not be a, a poetic matchup. Mankind and Mark Henry, single elimination here, one-on-one. -on -one. There's got to be a winner in this matchup. And the winner advances in the uh, Intercontinental Title Tournament. And, uh, oh, oh, look at uh, this. Well, folks, business is picking up early in this one because there she is, the ninth wonder of the world, the object of Mark Henry's affection, and the recipient of a sexual harassment lawsuit from the world's strongest man. And right now, if I were Mark Henry, I'd file for a restraining order. Keep your distance, China. Well, this certainly's got to make uh, Mark Henry a little more uncomfortable, as if the unpredictability of mankind wow. wasn't enough. Look at that, look at that. Tremendous power by the, uh, the man who represented the United States in the 1996 Olympics. He was the captain of the weightlifting team. Look at this streak! And uh, Mankind got to be close to the 300-pound mark, but you couldn't tell it by oh, Mark Henry looking right for the ankle. Mark Henry, that some 400 pounds right down on the on the ankle of, of Mankind here. And Mark Henry's game plan, oh man, is to take that left ankle of, of Mankind and destroy it. And China's game plan is to stand there and stare and distract Mark Henry. But so far, it's not working. He's paying absolutely no attention to it. And that's smart. Folks, again, we are still awaiting the arrival of Stone Cold Steve Austin here to the uh, Nassau Coliseum. Mr. McMahon is welcoming Austin with open arms. I don't get that. I don't get it. Well, something's up. Got to be something up there. And something's going up right now. 400 pounds of Mark Henry taking it to that second uh, rung. Move your leg, you have it, you better. And Mankind, a veteran move there, saw it coming all the way, able to avoid the contact. That would have crushed his leg. Mankind 
has been a WWF Tag Champion, but never a, a singles champion here in the World Wrestling Federation. Oh. You know, you gotta believe that somewhere right now, Stone Cold is driving his truck or whatever, his car, his limo, his taxi, whatever it may be, here to the Coliseum, and Mr. McMahon awaits. What's gonna go down when Austin gets here? And the DDT. Mankind, what's he doing here, King? Mankind taking that shoe off. His ankle may be broken. What's he got that? He got that athlete's foot up it. Oh, that'd be the only thing athletic about him, his feet. Well, Mr. Mr. Sarko. Oh, and no. with Mr. Sarko. Oh, no. And it, it may be a prelude. It no. may be. Yes, yes it is. is. No. The mandible claw. The mandible claw. Mankind's mandible claw ah. is taking Mark Henry down. And Mankind beats Mark Henry with a mandible claw. Thanks to Mr. Sarko. Oh, come on. Here is your winner, Mankind. Not right. Sticking that filthy, stinking Mr. Sacco right down the gullet of Mark Henry. If who, can, who can survive that? Mandible cloth, bad enough, but that uh, rather stinky sweat sock, that's, that's the world's strongest sock. Well, again, mankind is scheduled to be Ken Shamrock. Hey, hey, this Sunday at Tuesday at this pay per view, China is going up into the ring. Well, this could get ugly again in a hurry. True love waits, China. Be careful, you're being sued. What I always was. What's up, Russell? What's up, Russell? like China was asking Mark Henry why. Why the lawsuit? Mark Henry said it's out of my hands. I guess meaning that it's in the, the legal system's hands now. Oh, yeah. Now. Once a lawyer gets his hooks in you, you're history. It is a little perplexing. China being sued by Mark Henry for sexual harassment. Wait a minute.